Everyone gets tired of beanie weenies and ramen noodles, right? Well, so do the hungry rig hands working throughout western Oklahoma. The Oklahoman's Adam Wilmoth reports catering businesses are among those operations springing up in the western part of the state, all to support the booming oil fields. Wilmoth reports exploration and production companies often have food catered during the hydraulic fracturing, or fracking, stage of a well process. That's when the most people are on site at once. Depending on the size and depth of the well, the process can require between 25 and 90 people on site at any given time. And having food on site is beneficial to the rig hands and their companies. We serve a meat of starch and three vegetables, uh, dessert, salad, drinks, and uh, they get to self-serve. So they get what they want and how much they want, um, which is really nice for them because we have little guys and we have big guys. Oh, we got some amazing foods. We have uh, everything from low country bowls, filet mignon, uh, ribeyes, down to just a sub bar, deli bar. All of our rolls and desserts are made homemade. We have a little lady here by the name of Pearly Rogers, and she hand rolls our rolls every morning, and uh, she lets them rise, and, and we all stand in line when they come out of the oven and, and take a buttered roll out, they're just amazing. Um, from cobblers to cakes to all of that, it's, it's like walking into a bakery, it's amazing. As long as you, you feed these guys during the day where they don't have to bring their own food and, and uh, eat whenever they can, if you give them a couple of regular scheduled meals, I think you'll get a better job out of them and they appreciate it, so they'll, they'll do a better job. We let the guys pick what they want to eat. Um, we feel since they're away from their family and their wives cooking and mom's cooking for them that, you know, let them have a choice.